A typical day for me is I usually wake up at uh, 3.15, 3.30. You have a good day, all right? Get here about seven o'clock every morning. <laughs> and uh, that's when the mad rush begins. So my name is Jeffrey Wright. I teach uh, physics here at Louisville Mill High School. You can never fall asleep in his class. It's loud and exciting and energetic. Mr. Wright is pretty crazy. Two recovers electrons all the way around. Go! Biscuits, that hurt! <laughs> he tells the best jokes ever. Most of his jokes aren't really funny, but I think they are. Test question alert. I'm a lousy lecturer. We do labs all the time. Crazy experiments. A potato cannon. He's built a hovercraft. Oh my god, I cleared him. I want them to be able to apply what they learn to real life. He makes you think about the connections between everything in the world. I am learning life in class. Anytime I can put a little philosophical twist on some physics laws, I try to do that. He could go by the book and just teach that way. We'd learn it, but we want to appreciate it. Velocity and distance and how to find the coefficient of friction, that's not the real lesson he's teaching us. He's teaching us that when things get really tough, not to give up. And we do a lot in science as we fail. And that's one of the biggest things they have to learn at the beginning of this class. We all know how hard this life can be. Things are going to get really tough, and we're not going to want to keep trying. We're just going to want to walk away from the situation. If I fail, or if something doesn't work out like I think it's going to work out, then I keep trying, because you're never, ever going to be right all the time. Everybody sort of has that spark inside of them, just like the spark you saw inside the plasma ball. Sometimes we have to get up enough nerve, enough guts, to reach down and touch that spark. It's not until you touch other people that that light actually glows. And that's what I want them to get out of. They gotta give back to other people before they can actually make this world a little bit brighter. He's more of a friend. We like his family, kind of, because he puts that much into us. He like goes the extra step. The extra mile, not even the extra mile, I think he goes the extra 2,000 miles to make sure everyone understands. They really don't care how much you know until they know how much you care about them. Stop. That's your dream, right? Yes. Yeah, so, why do you want this job? Those are the big things in their lives. They're not going to care about Newton's laws until they get that other stuff sort of settled out. I don't think you got to be a counselor or a psychologist. You just got to have some genuine care about a person. Man is so limited to what we can understand ultimately that uh, we've got to believe in something much greater. Life can't be explained by just law after law after law. It has to be based on something a lot deeper, and that's the, the love we have for each other.